welcome to Komino Island, Blue Lagoon. Komino is a small island between the islands of Malta and Gozo in the Mediterranean Sea. It is a part of the Maltese archipelago along with Gozo, measuring 3.5 square kilometers in area. The name Komino is derived from the flowering cumin plant which covers the island, along with other wildflowers and herbs, making it a beautiful sanctuary of nature and wildlife. During summer, it is one of the most tourist-dense area because of its crystal clear water. Now let's begin our journey from Silimas Ferries Ferry Terminal. Sorry, can I uh, put my things there already? Or? No, you have to wait Cannot. until the crew opens the boat at 9.30. 9.30. Okay. Yes. Thank you so much. Thank you.
So you guys going for a dip later? Absolutely no. not. No. 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 <laughs> no. <laughs> That's why you have that, I guess. That you can do that. <laughs> you can have our dip. I know they have a water slide here. Yeah. They have, yeah. That's the reason why I booked this uh, one. <laughs> a couple of years ago, I was here with our son. And we went off for a day, yeah. and when we got to, it may have been uh, a Camino, which has been so long, but you got um, free flippers, goggles, and a breathing tube. Ah, he was, loved it. Okay. Ah, he was, was 15? 15 at, 15 at the time. He loved it. Loved it. And the water, you were saying the water is so water clear. Is so clear. Yes, it is. Really, yeah. really, really clear. I tried uh, diving here. Yeah. Big diving here. Paddy yeah. is a big thing here. Yeah. And did you enjoy it? Yeah, uh, but comparing to Philippines, uh, here there's not much coral reef. Here it's just more of like a grass and shipwreck. They did, they did. Just recently, they also did one in Gozo. But that's about it. Just grasses, gra sea grass, and then sunken ships. And is there any animal? I mean, is there any life underneath there? Like there is, but small fishes. Okay, that's, that's good. But uh, because I'm coming from Asia, which we have nice coral reefs where it's very colorful, like the. Yeah, Mediterranean doesn't do color. It doesn't do. It's just yeah, dark. Yeah, yeah. The, but it's. Because the fact it's, that most of it. Uh, one one difference I notice is the water is less salty here. Like in Asia, it's a little bit more salty. Because every time every time I jump, I usually drink the water. Okay. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> really? Unintentionally. Why would that be? I'm not sure. Maybe because it's inside the like it's Mediterranean, it's so exit. yeah, yeah. I mean, you've only got two exits. I mean, at the south of Spain, and yeah. up to Rota, and then way over. Yeah. Or I'm losing my sense of taste. <laughs> we'll try it. Back to Steven and we shall be back at Steven's around half past five 
quarter to six this afternoon. The weather forecast for today, the weather should be partly cloudy with a temperature of 29 degrees Celsius. The wind should be for three to four coming from the west southwest. For those of you planning to do any swimming later on at Comino, the sea temperature is that of 28 degrees Celsius. So as you can see, we are now cruising out of Stima Creek. Ahead of us to the right, you can see Monta's capital city, Valletta, which is built on the peninsula of Chiveras. It is named after the French bread master Jean Parizeau de la Vallette. We can also see St. Paul's Anglican Cathedral on our right hand side. And right ahead of us at the point of the Valletta, you can see Fort St. Elmo. When viewed from the air, this fort resembles a five pointed star nowadays. For St. Elmo Houses, the Wall Museum. Ladies and gentlemen, I would like to point out some safety information about the boat in case of an emergency. Life jackets are to be found underneath some of the seats with the compartment marked life jackets. The unlikely event of an emergency, the general alarm of the boat will sound. Please stay calm, leave all your belongings behind, and proceed to the master station, which is to be found downstairs on the main deck midship. Over there, the crew will be giving you life jackets and will guide you towards the emergency exits of the boat, which are to be found on either side of the vessel. It is also very important to follow the instructions given by the crew at all times. May I also remind you that the bar is open on the lower deck, serving as snacks, sandwiches, hot dogs, beers, wine, tea, coffee and soft drinks. Toilet facilities are to be found on the lower deck as well. For the smokers on board, smoking is only allowed on the back of the boat downstairs. So for the smokers on board, smoking is only allowed on the back of the boat downstairs. And well, whilst wishing you a pleasant day trip with us, ladies and gentlemen, if you have any questions or need anything, please do not hesitate to contact me at the wheelhouse or any other member of the crew. Thank you. It was nothing, it was, um, it was just used as a marker oh, to yeah. say this was the end oh, yeah. of the point. I see. But as they went past it, everybody used to bless themselves, say, and it was after that that they got the name of Shlema. Oh, wow. So it's Shlema Maria, etc. in Maltese.
21 such towers were built around the coasts of Malta and Goto to protect the islands during the Great Siege of 1565. There are seven of them around Gozo and 14 around Malta. In case of others and the enemy was spotted, they used to light a bonfire oh, to my. alarm each other because those days no mobile phones existed. During his stay here of only three months, he converted the island from paganism into Christianity. In fact, St. Paul is the patron saint of Malta.
Signore le grotte di Comino che si chiama le grotte di Santa Maria. cave here or there are more caves to so see the outer point of Comino and this is known as the elephant's head rock. The reason is that when it comes to a certain angle it has the shape of that of the elephant's head. In fact ladies and gentlemen you can see it exactly on the right hand side of the boat now not the left it's the right hand side of the boat that rock is known as the elephant's head rock on the right hand side of the boat now thank you alla destra della barca si vede la porta e si levanta
So I repeat the departure times for those passengers who are disembarking in Gozo. The passengers with the white wristbands will pick you up again at 2.20. The passengers staying the whole day in Gozo at 10 minutes past 4. 16 and 10. Thank you. Sorry, sir. You cannot stay here while we're in the highway. Okay.
convent very clear. Okay? And as I have said, ladies and gentlemen, we are stopping over in this bay until 12.20, where you'll be able to go for a swim off the boat, and then we will continue with our trip to the Blue Lagoon. Benvenuti al Baia di San Nicola, l'isola di Comino, qua fermiamo fine alle 12 eventi per fare il bagno dalla barca e poi andiamo alla Laguna Blu, grazie. Okay, you have this. No, no, you, you will not. You want to use this? Yeah. Yeah. I try. I, I, I have to.
Close already? I'm here in Colmin Island now.
for me.
take a shower, head back to the boat, and let's see if I can fly my drone. Pineapple. They have lockers as well.
some people are just chilling out, sunbathing. Some are just uh, sitting, chilling in, in the shade, drinking beer. Oh, she's very far already. over there is uh, Gozo Island. It's very near Comino. And there's some Mama Mary boat over here. Yes, I did. I went there. I went, uh, we, we had the slide over there. And then I flew my drone there. Did you do the slide? Yeah. Really? And did you just fly the drone? Yeah, I'll show you the video. Here. Can you see it? Uh, let, me, let me put the screen. You flew it off the bow, yeah? Yeah, over there. Was it good? See? Yeah, it, it's nice. You think it's a big boat, but it's very small compared to the ones that are prepared to Yes, it is. Did you enjoy it? You did? I did, yeah. It's good. good. It's really Just good. That's all you want? The, the tide is really, like, strong. Is it? When, I, when we were there, I thought I couldn't go back on the boat because it keeps pulling me away. Yeah, here it's okay because we're on the shore, but we went there in the middle of the, the, the sea. And are you a strong swimmer? No. And you, should you be? You probably should be. <laughs> well, it's it's sea, so you'll float anyways. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Did you enjoy it? Yeah. Good. See, they have the slide out. They have, but they're not using it. They are jumping over there. Did you go around Gozo? Yeah, yeah, yeah. We did, yeah. yeah it was lovely. We enjoyed it. It was nice doing it on the on the coach. Uh -huh. The coach was very comfortable. It was lovely. And a lot of things have changed in it since we were. Yeah. Um, I think everything has changed. You know, but everything changes anyway. So. How was it? You loved it? Uh, yeah, the, uh, Victoria now has changed. Uh-huh. Yeah, there's lots of places have obviously changed. What what kind of change? Like uh, a lot of us... Toes. Ah, I yeah. I would think the pandemic has done a lot of that, you know? Yeah. And, uh, look at where we're finding But I think they should be like going back to normal now because there's people probably got out of business and decided, well, that's it, I'm not going to do anymore. Ah, uh, yeah, they found better ones. Yeah. During the pandemic, a lot of uh, people yeah. shift to yeah. something new, yeah. which they yeah. they would yeah. they will not do if they um, have a choice. A lot of people that came from the Eastern European countries like Poland and all that, they, a, lot, a lot of those went back to their own countries. Yeah. Ah, yeah, so some of the people who were doing business there are from other countries. So when they went back, the shops closed as well. You should go for a swim. I don't swim. <laughs> okay. I would like to. I'll go around. And I'm not so sure yeah. if I'm... I, uh, but 
there's every opportunity to learn. I mean, there's, we have plenty of swimming pools near us. And maybe it might be something that you yes. should do. Yeah. Well, I know they say if you have any, um, say, a knee replacement or a hip replacement, yeah. all the surgeons now recommend that you tread water. Like swim? In, in a swimming pool. Oh, okay. It's good for your joints. Yeah. So maybe I should start thinking about yeah, swimming. Yeah, you should. I'll, uh, yeah, actually yeah. I might do that. Now you go and enjoy it. Yeah, you can. Uh, yeah, we'll talk to you later. Yes, see ya. See you later. So those are two lovely couples. And see how kind Luzu Cruz, shout out to Luzu Cruz, this um, staff. They are very helpful, They're very friendly. I guess that's why they are the most recommended. So now let's uh, have a quick walk. Here at uh, again Blue Lagoon. Let's uh, do a real quick tour. What's up? Good. Good. Did you? Are you enjoying? Yes. Yeah. Yes. Where are you guys from? Libya. Libya. Okay. Yes, I know. Yeah. Hours, yeah, yeah. Hours. Just touring is okay. I won't uh, keep you. Uh, enjoy. Nice to see you. Nice to meet you. Uh, nice what's to meet your you. name? What's your name? Saga. Saga. Uh, uh, you? Can call me Shin. Shin. Yeah. Enjoy. Take care. Maybe we'll meet in the future. Thank you. Yeah, see you. Thank you. Bye bye. One thing you'll notice here in uh, Comino is uh, it's not dirty and there are some trash bits so nice it's a very nice uh, the government is doing a great job here in Comino
much for the pineapple? 10, 10 euros are with alcohol and the 8 euro no alcohol. 10 euro with alcohol and the 8 euro no alcohol. Do you, ac do you accept card? Yes, yes. Card Can I have uh, one without alcohol? The bees are enjoying the pineapple. You come back. Yeah? That's the big bee. If it bites you, it goes straight to the Really? Yes. So be careful. Very dangerous. And you're just happy no, not the, with the them. Big ones, the big ones. Small ones, no, they are friendly. The small ones are friendly. They are friendly? The big ones dangerous.
Do you want me to take your picture?
Did you swim over there? Did you swim over there? How was it? <laughs> Not good. Another uh, location? Yeah? Nothing interesting. <laughs> it's not worth it going there. It's not worth going there. 15 minutes. Ah, uh, that's too far. <laughs> yeah, yeah, we leave at 4, so around 30 minutes. Pretty little facilities are to be found on the lower deck as well, so please pass in your seat. 